What's up friends, this is Money and welcome to another video showing my struggle with the Enforcer boss or AC in Armored Core 6 at the bottom of the uh, Watchpoint Alpha exploration basically uh, and uh, I didn't know what was gonna happen I came here the first time I saw there's a resupply point so I decided to take it after a few seconds of consideration thinking hmm if they give me that there's probably gonna coming a boss after this and so it was yeah I resupplied one last time and then I went myself onto a dying streak, okay? <laughs> so let's go and find out who the enforcer is and how he's gonna kick my butt for quite a few times. So I found a big open room that already told me everything I need to know about this place. And here comes, asked to little surprise, uh, a big juicy boss. The enforcement system says intruder detected, defense program phase three sends the so-called enforcer. Switching him to termination mode, which sounds righty, uh, mighty dangerous. <laughs> Com considering the size of this guy, I, uh, yeah, I think his cannon is probably as big as me, so. Terminating target. Oh, man, look at this dude. <laughs> that looks dangerous. Yeah, so let's start. Like I said, this was my first experience. I got actually really lucky that I dodged the first shot. I saw him preparing some blue laser stuff. I was like, hmm, okay, maybe I have to dodge. And it worked. Later on, I understood how difficult it actually was to dodge this laser. Then I understood, man, he's got some melee stuff as well. All right, I've got to be careful. The dual songbirds, however, are pretty good at staggering him. So it seems like staggering and, uh, you know, impact damage isn't the problem against him. But even though I'm hitting him pretty hard, he's not really taking a lot of damage just yet. And I'm not running the Zimmerman shotgun right here. I'm running the Chang Chan, Chang Chen, uh, the uh, machine gun. And thankfully I got him staggered here, gave him a really, really big hit um, as he was staggered with uh, the pile bunker charged. That is a big, big hit. And then uh, he gets me a few times with his melee attacks. Thankfully I still have some repair uh, kits that I'm gonna use. Now I only have one left. And you see, I, uh, I'm i trying to figure him out. I'm trying to understand his moveset. I'm trying to understand what I need to do against him. Uh, but before I really can figure out more, that was the end of part one, or my first try. Now, skip ahead three tries later, okay? Boom. This is basically just try number four now. Every time you see another try, I had three in between. I didn't show you like 20 tries now. I think it would be a too long of a video, but... Every time uh, I, I learn something new, I show you a new try. And it's basically like every time there's two or three attempts in between. In which pretty much the same or similar happened than before. And now I, you see I learned his pattern with the movement. I know he does two ground slashes. And uh, that I can dash either go, going backwards or sideways. And then he does one that I should definitely get above the strike to dodge it. And uh, that, I was able to do that pretty well. Then I tried to get up there and maybe find a calm quiet place for a second to, you know, get myself back and, and cool cool down for a sec, but uh, turns out you can't fly that high. There's a area limit up there. So I'm bound to, uh, yeah, basically with him here in this short range brawl, the CQB combat. And I'm already dead, boom. All right, so that was basically attempt number three or four or something like this. So let's get, get ahead, two or three more attempts later, this happened. I learned how to dodge the first attack and I understood that I need my Zimmerman shotgun again. So I switched to the Zimmerman shotgun in my main, uh, or well, in my right hand. Uh, that in combination with the pile bunker is a really good way to get him staggered. Um, and you'll see that here very quickly. I come in, I hit him one time, I hit him another time and poof, staggered. And then I can follow up with a massive charged pile bunker doing a ridiculous amount of damage. So for now, it looks pretty good. And I see, again, his melee attack pattern. I'm gonna dodge it upwards. I learned that upwards dodging is the best way to do this. And boom! Another charged pile bunker in his face. So it looks like I have a chance. Then I thought he's gonna take a melee attack. Because this is the first time I get him below 50%. And, uh, and I, I, I thought he was gonna do a melee attack, but it wasn't. He did something different. He charged some other thing up. So I stunned him again. I hit him hard and he's almost dead. And then he starts doing some moves that I haven't seen before. This melee attack, I always was able to do dodge it by going up in the high in the sky uh, or high up. But this time his attack was changed. And so he got me, even though I was trying to do what I did before, getting above it, right? So attempt number whatever, five, six didn't work. And then here we come with the 
final attempt, the one that, uh, spoiler alert, will be a victory. Maybe two or three attempts later again. It may be the 10th attempt or 9th or 11th. I don't know exactly how many it was. But I tried him quite a few times before I got this run. And, uh, but the see you saw, the previous one was really close already. One more charged pile bunker hit that I kind of messed up in the end. Um, uh, and uh, he would have been done. So I knew I could beat him now and I knew the strategy. I had the strategy down. I just need to get the right thing happen at the right time in the battle. And here we go. Boom. 50%. And then I also learned that while, when he gets 50%, he does that. But I can interrupt him as he charges up at whatever he does. I don't know exactly what he's doing at 50%, but I think he makes himself stronger or so. And I can hit him hard, stun him, and just had him hit him again with a pile bunker. Coming in one more time. This time, not a charged pile bunker because I didn't have the time for it. Because he was already too far away after my double sunbird stun. Uh, and then here one more time. Coming in and BAM! There goes the Enforcer. So, ladies and gents, if you enjoy these videos, uh, well, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet, because this channel is all about Armored Core, uh, and we have all kinds of updates for new content or up patches in general, or even some world records that you can find here on the channel, where I did some ridiculously fast kills against the Nightfall Raven, for example, and other, like V4 Rusty and so on. Speaking of V4 Rusty, there is actually in this very same mission here, coming a V4 Rusty battle later, but I thought this deserves another video, because it's a very special occasion and situation, because it's V4 Rusty, it's our buddy. So yeah, thanks for watching, have a good one, Manny signing off, bye-bye.